now we're talking about weather here locally. Let's head on over to Brian Goddard to tell us more about the snowfall that we had. Some people, you know, we got exactly what you were calling for, Brian, but of course some people I talked to out in Kenosha County today said, yeah, we got hit harder than I expected. Maybe by an inch. They had nine, not, Kenosha and Pleasant Prairie had nine inches of snow. We were saying four to seven, okay, by two inches. You got a little bit more snow. It kept going last night. It just would not stop after nine, ten o'clock. Uh, even up till midnight, it was still snowing. What happened is that northeast wind kicked in, and we got just a little bit of a, a lake enhancement, I guess you want to say. So it added a quick another one to two inches late last night. There's the storm system that brought us the snow. Uh, it was the heavy, wet variety as we expected it to be. And here comes the next storm system that helped this storm intensify over us. These two merge, and there's already been hearing one to two, maybe even three feet of snow around Boston. Boston's record snowfall is 27 and a half inches of snow. They may break that. That was back in like 1995, I believe, or something like that. I'll have to take a look exactly. But travel out east, not looking good. For us, not bad. It's still cloudy from that storm system, but as the day wears on, we'll start to see a little bit more sunshine as high pressure gets in here. It is brisk with that northwesterly wind, wind chills in some areas. Right now, are still in the single digits, warming up back off to the west of us, and we'll start to see that warm up for tomorrow as the 30s get back in here. The jet stream is going to lift to the north. We'll see sunshine tomorrow. It's going to be great to be outdoors uh, if you want to go snowmobiling, skiing. I know a lot of folks want to do some cross country skiing around here. It hasn't had been great conditions for the last two winters. Quite a bit of snow on the ground now, but all good things come to an end. Quiet today, nice tomorrow. It's going to be great, but Sunday starts off with sleet. Freezing rain and then changes over to all rain throughout the day. This is how much snow fell two to four to the north, a big swath of four to seven as we thought. And then this was the band that set up yesterday from Lake Geneva to uh, Burlington had about seven inches of snow. Milwaukee had just under six inches of snow and Kenosha Pleasant Prairie right at nine Racine at about eight and a half. Still cloudy here in Milwaukee, as I mentioned, but the sun will come out throughout the afternoon at the airport. You can see cloudy and snow covered 25 degrees. Northwesterly wind is at 12 to 20 keeping wind chills in the single digits and teens. Actual temperatures 20 in Fond du Lac, 26 in Kenosha and 19 in Waukesha. As that sun comes out, even though temperatures will be below freezing today, that sun's getting stronger, so that'll help melt off some of that uh, crud on your sidewalks and your driveways. Wind chills, as I mentioned, single digits to the teens, so it's a little brisk out there and it's going to get cold tonight. Gradual clearing, a light wind, and a fresh blanket of snow on the ground, single digits across the region, and we may even drop below zero well inland, but at least the wind is light, so no wind chill. Then we warm up rapidly tomorrow. Beautiful sunshine at or slightly above freezing across the entire region and winds between 5 and 15. Not bad at all, all thanks to this high pressure system. While it's nice here, it is miserable out east. And then here comes the next storm system. Storm system number six so far this month. Crazy. In the morning hours, just cold enough to see a wintry mix of sleet, possibility of some snow, a less than an inch of accumulation, and then freezing rain we're going to have to watch out for. And then rain in the afternoon could be heavy at times, and they're expecting blizzard conditions back into Minnesota. Better than than us. 28 degrees today, clearing. Not a bad day once the sun comes out. 8 degrees tonight, 2 in Waukesha under a clear sky and a light breeze. Seven-day forecast. We stay mild. The coldest is 28 on Tuesday. And just a little bit of light snow on Monday as that system pulls on out of here. Otherwise, finally quieting down. We're back after this.